Hi you guys, good morning. Welcome back to my channel or if you guys are new here, welcome. My name is Katie. I just woke up and I went to go make coffee and then I realized that I had no creamer. That's like the worst feeling in the morning whenever you're like just ready to have your coffee but you can't make it. So, whew, I'm so sleepy. Okay, let's go get coffee so I can wake up and function. Um, yeah, let's do that first. <laughs> Starbucks, we're gonna get started for you. Hi there, can I please have a venti vanilla latte? And can you make that with almond milk? I just got this mask from Windsor. It's like really, really comfy and it's like silky, so it's really comfortable to wear. Um, and I know like a lot of the like the ones that you can buy, like the blue masks or any other like really like cloth ones with kind of like the white on the inside, it feels very like, I don't know, to me it always gets really itchy. So I'll link this one down below because I love this one. It is so, so comfortable. And it's like the perfect fit too. Hi, how are you? Good morning, good, thank you. There we go. Venti triple vanilla almond milk latte, 720. Thank you. Thank you. All good. Awesome, have thank you so much, Thanks. have a good one. Thank you. Okay, got the coffee. It really made me think after paying like after tax around like eight dollars for coffee how like much I really love my Keurig and how much I actually use it. I know you guys like ask all the time um about like which one that I have and stuff like that um so I'll have it linked down below if you guys are interested. It is a little bit more expensive. I think it's around like two hundred dollars but I'm telling you guys I use it so frequently and it's truly just like um it's the best like coffee maker that I've probably ever had and I use it every single morning I don't get tired of it you can do so many different things with it and honestly like by the time you buy 25 of these coffees like you get you know Starbucks a lot like every day of the month or even two months you will have like already bought yourself the Keurig so definitely such a good thing to invest in if you guys buy a lot of like coffee out someone's excited to see me hi baby hi sweetheart good morning good morning harper good morning how are you okay come say hi to everybody can you say hi okay so if you guys do not follow me on instagram this is harper and she actually was supposed to just be my foster puppy. I was scrolling through Facebook maybe about like a week or so ago and I saw this picture that a local shelter had posted and it was like a bunch of puppies. I think she had a litter of maybe like nine or 10. The shelters were completely full and they didn't have anywhere for them to go so they were asking for fosters and it was supposed to just be like a short-term foster situation and I was like, you know what, like why not? Like I'm sure Kai would have fun having a little puppy here and I would love having a little puppy and you know, it would just be fun for a week. So I went and picked her up and poor thing, she had like the worst fleas. She had kind of like a rash all over her body. She had hookworms. She was just kind of in like bad shape. Um, she was really, really like skittish and timid and nervous whenever I first picked her up. So the first day that she got here, I gave her a little bath and she got all of her medicine in that she needed and now she's feeling all good. But within 24 hours, she like completely won over my heart. She's like the most cuddly little thing. She's so cute. She's such a happy little girl. So the first night she completely like laid right next to me and nuzzled her little head in between like my neck and my shoulders and she just loves to snuggle and so it like melted my heart. So I actually ended up filling out her adoption paperwork. Um, ow, you can't bite me. That's not how this works. Where's your toy? Oof, here, bite Mr. Bear. That's what is here to bite. He's here to be bitten. Yeah, you, you can chew on him. You can't chew on me, nope. And yeah, so I filled out her adoption paperwork. So she is now officially a part of the family and her and Kai, I know some of you guys like had questions on my Instagram because I already talked about this on my Instagram. Um, about her and Kai, they are still kind of warming up to each other. Um, I think Kai is still feeling like really kind of like jealous that I'm giving my attention to something else. Um, and I don't think he likes having to like share his toys and share his bed and everything like that. Especially sharing the bed at nighttime because I let Harper sleep in bed with me just because she hates the crate and I'm not a fan of putting dogs in crates. Harper is still, I think, kind of getting used to him as well because Kai plays really rough, most German Shepherds do, 
and he's so much bigger than she is. So if he comes up to her and kind of like paws her playfully, it just like shoves her to the ground. So I think once they both kind of get used to each other, they'll be really, really good friends and play a lot because they're super sweet to each other now. Um, but she just gets a little bit like timid and nervous whenever he tries to play with her. So I think they'll be best friends though. What do you think? Mwah. What do you think? Yes. Anyways, I just wanted to introduce her to you guys because obviously you will be seeing her in my video. So yeah, this is Harper. Oh my gosh, you guys, Harper just got up and went to lay down to snuggle with Kai. This is the closest that they have like ever been to snuggling and it is so cute. Oh my gosh. Okay, you guys, just got out of the shower, kind of just blue dry my hair, straightened the ends. I'm going to go ahead and do a little bit of makeup. If I keep fiddling with my robe, it's because Harper ran off with like the string that ties it. So it's just like sitting there. So hopefully it doesn't like fly open and flash you guys. Um, okay, so... So I am just doing my usual little bit of Laura Mercier tinted moisturizer. I love this stuff because it has SPF 30. And then I mix a little bit of that in with my It Cosmetics um, CC Plus full coverage. I really need a self tan again because these foundations are like my shades when I'm tanned. So they're definitely like a bit more dark and like orangey than my skin is right now, but Oh well, it's fine. I love this combo because it makes your skin look like so like natural and it looks like an actual skin texture versus like a bunch of um, like cakey foundation. Looks so good. My ears are always red too. I don't know why. I just always get like a really red face and red ears. I need a little bit of powder. I really need to get my eyebrows done. They are so wild. I haven't plucked them in forever. I've just been lazy with them to be completely honest. I feel like I've been lazy with everything. I don't know why lately. It's just like a lot easier to not get ready than to like actually get ready. I'm trying to be better at it because I feel like I just look honestly like a bum 24 seven. And I really feel like it makes you like feel better whenever you actually get ready. I know it takes time, but I don't know. I always just like feel better. Wow, that is a little strong. Um, I always just feel better. Like whenever I'm getting ready or like I'm ready for the day, it just makes me feel more productive. And I don't know, just makes me feel better. Also, I need to go get a new bronzer because this one is almost out. So I think I'm going to go to Sephora today, get some new bronzer, shampoo, conditioner. And then while I'm at the mall, I'm also gonna be picking up um, one of my Christmas giveaway prizes for you guys. I'm doing, I don't know how many giveaways I'm doing yet. I know I'm for sure doing one at least once a week in December. And I have a bunch of like amazing prizes. I know you guys are gonna love. I've um, teamed up with a few brands and it's gonna be so much fun. One of the giveaways, I'm actually gonna be giving away that purse that I showed in my Amazon video because I know so many of you guys have been trying to get your hands on it, but you haven't been able to because it's sold out like everywhere online. Also you guys, I just recently started using a new mascara. I know that I've use like the L'Oreal Voluminous Lash forever, but I actually recently switched to um, the Charlotte Tilbury Fat Full Lashes, and this one is so much better. I think that L'Oreal recently changed the formula in the Voluminous one, because I naturally have very, very curly lashes. Like they're always like going straight up. I don't have to curl them or anything, and it's been like that with like my entire life and with any mascara, but then I recently got a new bottle of the L'Oreal one, and I'm not even kidding, my lashes were going like straight out. I've never experienced that before. So I don't know what they changed to it, but it's not working for me anymore, so I switched, and I love this one so much better. It's just, it's just so pretty and really does make your lashes like so nice and full and lengthened. It's not clumpy or anything. It's truly like the perfect mascara. Okay, puppies, I'll be right back. Okay, guys, I just got to the mall, so I'm gonna go ahead and head in to 
do a little Christmas shopping for you guys. I'm so excited on the way here. I was thinking of some more things I wanted to get for you guys for the giveaway. Also, I realized that I have not mentioned in this video yet of something that would be kind of fun for our community to do. So I thought as a community, it would be fun to do Operation Christmas Child together this year. And if you guys don't know what Operation Christmas Child is, it's an organization that um, sends like shoe boxes full of essentials. So whether that's like a hairbrush or, you know, shoes or um, like shirt stuff like that along with a few toys like little games or hair accessories or you know like a um, soccer ball and stuff like that to children all around the world who are in need who are living in poverty and no one in their community has the ability to you know even get the gifts let alone they might not even have shoes to wear these shoe boxes are only $25 each is a super simple process to make online and it's such an easy quick but such an impactful way to kind of give back over the holiday season so I created a page for us and the goal that I put is 50 boxes by December 20th so that hopefully they can get there kind of around Christmas time um, so I'll have the link down below if you guys are interested with that being said I completely understand that this has been a really hard year for everybody especially financially so, so if you are not able to participate please don't worry about it um, it's not a big deal this is something you know just fun that I thought that you know I would just if you guys were interested feel free if you guys are really interested in building a box but you're not able to afford it at this time feel free to DM me and I will do my best to buy a box in your name um, I know there's a lot of you guys and I shared this on my Instagram as well so I probably Probably can't buy everyone's box but I will do my best if that's something that you're really interested in doing but it's not within your financial means at this time so I'm super excited about this um, we already have our first few boxes purchased and I'm really excited to see what we do as a community so so the link to the page and everything like that is gonna be linked down below if you guys want to check that out um, anyway so I wanted to mention that really quickly because I know we're already like into November and so I wanted to kind of give you guys like a head start on that um, I'm super excited to see what all we do as a community okay you guys just got to Sephora it was so funny um, I was trying to film and they had me fill out like an entire little thing for filming bite beauty is amazing especially their daytime um, lip balm I've had so many tubes of it and so I just got a whole bunch also got a bunch of really good gift sets right now so if you guys are looking for any good gifts right now definitely go to Sephora and the lady said that they've been selling out like super quickly they have so many good ones and then you guys know too that first aid beauty is one of my favorites I've been using them for the longest time and they actually have an entire gift set if you guys have never tried them and you wanted to right now they have them for only $49 so definitely go check out Sephora if you're looking for any gifts they have so many good deals right now and I know that right now they're in the middle of like their whole sale so I've been trying to find like a really good bronzer and I heard really good things about this hourglass one this one is the one that I just got um, you can't touch anything because it's all like you, they don't want anyone touching the testers which I totally understand so I'll have to try that out let you guys know what I think of it but I've heard so many good things about this one and then I also got a Marc Jacobs one that I've been wanting to try forever. Um, I got this one too, the Coconut Perfect Tan. I've heard so many great things about this. I'll show you guys really quick what all I got though. So like you guys saw in the store, I did pick up the Hourglass Bronzer. And then I also picked up the Marc Jacobs one. And I love this one because it's so big and I feel like it's going to last forever. I got two of the daytime um, lip balms from Bite Beauty. This stuff is absolutely amazing. It smells so good too. And I think it's only like $14 and it really does like last a while. So, and then I have also really been wanting to try Summer Fridays. I hear everyone raving about it. So I picked up their um, lip butter balm in vanilla. So that's just what that one looks like. But anywho, so yeah, that's everything that I got. Okay, you guys, just got back home and took the pups out. I got Chipotle once again. I just happen to be vlogging every single time that I go out to eat. But yeah, got my same bowl and then I got a bag of chips this time. Also, I had a very, very proud puppy parent moment when I got home because typically, especially if I'm gone, like I think I was gone for like two and a half hours maybe today. So like, especially if I'm gone for that long, I always come home and Harper like had a potty accident somewhere in the house. Um, just cause I don't like leaving them outside whenever I'm gone. So I do put a diaper on her, but typically like she either pees in her diaper or she poops somewhere or something like that. You guys, I came home and there was not one accident. She didn't even go in her diaper. It was great. So I am very proud of you. Come here. So you should take a girl. You should take a girl. You're learning not to go potty in the house. Mwah. 
I'm so proud of you. You're learning. Kai's like, Mom, I want you to pick me up too. Sorry, Kai, if you were 15 pounds, I would pick you up, but you're not. It's a little hard to pick up a doggo that's 110 pounds. It doesn't quite work that well. I literally do not know how this happens, but it happens all of the time. Like I just have the most random things. I leave my shoes everywhere. Like that's a given, like really bad habit. And so then Harper tries to chew them. So then I end up putting them like up here and I don't know why I'm not just taking them to my closet. I have like random paper. I have a bunch of stuff from like PR packages. And then I also have an entire chair full of clothes that I just got in from a brand today. So I know you guys like it whenever I show my like cleaning clips and stuff like that. So I'm gonna do a little time lapse. I just don't even like understand how this even happens. Like I have nowhere to put anything. It's amazing. Okay. Despite the loss, I'm over here, gotta get across. Whether you like it, like it or not, there is a moment meant for us. And now you made it, but I already played this. Not interested, open your eyes, let's get it done. Take my hand, just follow me. Shadow me, I won. Christmas stocking? <gasps> no, Harper. This is for Christmas. This is Santa Claus. This is Santa Claus and a reindeer. Harper. No, you can't have your Christmas stocking and your Christmas cookies. It's not time. You have to let them go. My goodness. Give me this. Give me, give me the stocking. Say, Mom is going to have to hide the stockings from you too because every time I leave, you guys find a way to get into your stockings and eventually one of you guys is gonna end up eating your Christmas cookies. And then you'll have no cookies for Christmas. Gosh, you guys have really just made an entire mess of my house. Yes, but you're cute, so it's okay. All right, you guys, it is quite a bit later. I need to go ahead and start taking off my makeup because it is just like all over the place. I got a PR package in from Burst that I'm gonna be trying out. Um, so I wanna see how their products work. And I've used a few of them before, but this one that I'm gonna be using tonight, I'm super excited about. They literally sent over like a huge box of goodies. Um, so I think tonight, I wanna try their cleansing balm. I've heard so many great things about this that focuses. Um, but I've been wanting to try this for a while and I've just never gotten around to it. So I think that is what I'm gonna do today. Take off all my earrings. Also, in case you guys are wondering where any of my jewelry is from, um, I'll have it all linked down below so you guys can check that out if you were interested. Okay, so it says to just massage a dime size amount and to dry skin using your wet fingertips. Okay, it's gonna be fingertips wet. Oh, it smells really nice too. I guess it's made from eucalyptus and vitamin E. So I'm just taking about this much. Let's see how this works. Okay, we'll say to say that it definitely takes off eye makeup. Okay, now what do I do with this now that's all over my hands? Okay, I have to say, I'm very impressed with that. It completely took off all of my makeup. That was so easy. There was no like having to pull with the cloth on your skin or anything. I am definitely gonna be incorporating this into my cleansing routine because this stuff is amazing. You know, this is my spot, right? Now there's nowhere for me to lay because you guys are both hogging the bed. One of you's gonna have to move. Okay, Harper, say goodnight to the vlog. Good night, guys. Good night. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>